pretty close to once in a super blue moon, is how you might describe the sight of Ted no Fuji fighting these days. Officially, he's discussing September with his master on Friday morning. But it's already clear his name won't be on the first list of published bouts. He missed training on Tuesday, we presume in favor of a physio session, did lightweight work and foot stamps on Wednesday, then only core movements this morning before the press were asked to leave the room. He did not give a comment afterwards. And although their stable groups differ, it is perhaps worth noting that coach Sendagawa quit sumo today. Reasons unexplained, meaning more elder stock in circulation. Asanoyama, on the other hand, is definitely in for September. I don't feel like sitting this one out, he told the press on Tuesday, despite largely avoiding practice bouts. My left bicep is much better, though I can't say the pain is completely gone, he added. And as for my big toe, the swelling has decreased, but the pain is still there. Clearly, it's a nightmare to try and fight when your big toe can't grip the ground. But I'll aim for double figures. At least, I will do my best. Dai Esho is yet further back on the mend. He resumed practice bouts inside his own stable on August 30th, then journeyed to Tokitsukaze stable on Tuesday this week for 12 encounters with Shodai, Toki Hayate, Kirishima, Gonoyama, and Asakoryu. Spornichi notes his thrusting power has largely returned. The man himself insists his right rib is okay for now. Kirishima fought 14 times at the same session, overpowering foes with his sharp belt maneuvers in front of some Mongolian guests from his one-time judo club. He'd rested up the day before as part of his battery recharge plan. Gonoyama fought one more bout than him, and looked especially strong against visiting Hokuseiho, breaking his belt grip with skill. He was summoned five times by Kirishima, and summarily routed, then told to push the Ozeki over the rope five times. He then hurtled into Dai Esho's chest as his coach Takekuma growled for more effort. They're different league in terms of raw strength, Gonoyama said of his elite level foes. I've got to train yet more solidly. That's exactly what he did, the Tokitsukaze stable fight in continuing for three days straight, we gather. On the second of those yesterday, Takakesho came along, fighting 13 times, mainly with Dai Esho and Takayasu. He lost four bouts straight to the latter and seemed unable to shove him backwards. Opening day is just round the corner, so I want to prepare good and proper, was all he would venture to say. The third Tokitsukaze session today was graced by Miyagi no Trio, Hokuseiho, Kiho, and Ten Shoho. Dai Esho took them all on, as well as Shodai and Tokihayate, for a total of nine practice bouts. He then finished with three more against Kirishima, having been called out by the latter. I will try to keep my Ozeki bid going, he said of the upcoming meet. I've left it late to gear up, I know, but I had to take care of that rib. I seem to be getting my rhythm back. And when he hits his stride, he's the best fighter here, said guest onlooker Hakuho. Gonoyama, meanwhile, stood up better to the test of Kirishima than he did two days ago, relentlessly attacking even when double-gripped. I thank him for calling me out, he said of their seven-bout session today. What a great practice I've had. 
Things are looking better for the tournament ahead. Hakuho praised Gonoyama's attitude as amazing, and held him up as a role model for his own prize students. And finally, Atami Fuji keeps whipping himself to do more. 26 practice bouts yesterday alone. He turned 21 last Sunday, receiving a new water bag as his present, and a line of balloons spelling happy birthday strung up across his room. Those attendants of his think of everything. It's already three years since I joined this stable, he reflected with some surprise. My first try in Division 1 was a bit all over the place. Although my condition's not there yet, I don't want a repeat of last time. My sights are set on the elite ranks. I want to reach them someday.